from what I know, my experience, managers uh, don't have the freedom to discuss or actually to give more money to people as they would like to. So you have a strict budget, you have some rules that you need to do. So in many situations, I heard uh, man managers, leaders that let's say, no, I know that my people are underpaid, but I cannot do anything about it. Uh, I know yeah. this, this is the reality, but I cannot do anything about it. This is what it is. I cannot change this just because I want my people to get more money. Yeah. Or I know that my people need more money. And that's a dangerous saying, like, I cannot do anything about it. Then, then if you, right, if, if you're there, and, and I know I've been there, right? So if you're there and if you're a manager of a team and you feel that the people are not paid fairly, for me at least, it, it, was, a, it was a value conflict. So, so on one side, I'm a manager of this organization and I have to kind of represent the organization in front of my people. And on the other side, I don't believe that the organization pays fairly, right? Mm -hmm, so that yeah, will reflect yeah. in the way I will lead my team. So I have two choices. Either I say, okay, so this is probably not something that I can do for much longer. Because if I just go to my team and say, it's nothing I can do about that, then that will not be enough for my team. Then I probably am in a, in a position where I don't feel comfortable as a leader. Or I could just take that responsibility for that question and, and just drive that initiative, you know, up in the organization and then start and bring awareness to my superior leaders and say okay you know you know have you ever thought about this like this is you know what i believe is is um it's what should be fair for our teams and we actually were not paying that and and if that's the case it will probably also show in turnover right so, mm -hmm. so that they will, those will be linked it's either yeah. if it's not only the manager's opinion that people are not paid fairly and and people believe the same, you know, sooner or later some of them will leave, right? And that way you will be able to to look at the situation. And what we have found is like the the a Gallup uh, you know survey with yeah. uh, you know that we have um, looked at, it found that um, you know it it costs somewhere between fifty percent to two hundred percent of their annual salary to replace someone. And then the question that I ask leaders, like you know, would you rather give 5% in salary increase every year, or would you pay the 50% fine of not giving that salary increase and people leaving, right? Which mm -hmm. one do you prefer? Mm 